Alright everybody, long time no see. It's work from on Friday. <laughs> Trent, what's the matter? Well, let me tell you a little story. I got this phone seven years ago. And in seven years, this phone hasn't been turned off for more than just to reboot it. I call it my brain because it has all my important stuff in it that I can't keep in this. I take pictures of things like refrigerator filters so I know what size to get or measurements that I need to take to Home Depot. It's all in here. When I go trail mapping, I use this to take the pictures and the videos and it flies my drone. It has been my constant companion. It served me so well. We are gonna go today. We took time off work. We were gonna go map trails and go up to Vale and have a nice weekend. And last night, I dropped it. I dropped it for probably the millionth time. But this time, I dropped it face down on the concrete. And it broke! Oh no! It won't even turn on the screen no more! But it still rings whenever someone's in the driveway. It says someone's in the driveway. I still work. <laughs> but it doesn't because I can't open the screen and I'm so sad. <laughs> we had to change our plans for our trip to Vail. So here we were going to get up and go early and get on the road and go mapping. But now we're going to the phone store to get another phone. And I'm never going to love it as much as I love this lady. But I probably will. Trent. What? They're not going to buy you a sissy case for your phone. No, you may not. I love those silicone cases. That silicone case protected my old phone for years and no. years. Drop my old phone all the time in the silicone case did fine until finally I dropped it flat on its face. You're not gonna win. Huh? The new phone is doing pretty good on our mapping day. I've only dropped it on the floorboard about four times. We've mapped three trails. We went down a fourth trail that turned out to not be a trail. So, uh, yeah, this used to be a road, but not anymore. How am I gonna get turned around? Someone moved the road closed sign so we didn't see it. But anyway, mapping is going well. We were headed back, kind of looping around to do another trail, but we're waiting on a tow truck because someone missed the turn and there's no guardrails in the mountains. something you don't see every day while you're four-wheeling. No, no, come back. I wanted that baby one. 
good. I'm so sorry. Well, there's more here. So we did it. We mapped all the things. And now it's the next morning and we're going to get a donut and coffee and a car wash. Yeah. Your truck is gross. It really, really is. I don't understand it, but sitting in a car should not be as tiring as it is when you go off-roading. My shoulders and arms are exhausted. My neck is really stiff. And for some reason, Tammy's feet hurt. Because I have to do this to push the pedals because sometimes you don't push the pedals right. I'm, you don't have pedals on your side. I'm pushing the pedals. But I have to do it for you because you scared the bejesus out of me. <laughs>